hello air signs welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for your likes your comments your shares and subscribes i truly appreciate them all air signs so let's get in. let's get a message for you guys for your week ahead please keep in mind this is general so the messages may or may not resonate with you take the messages that resonate with you your personal situations and leave the rest your signs. What's the overall energy for you? Oh, hello, Empress. Okay, Empress, you coming up here, of course. Libra energy. Um, hmm. Growth, expansion. Somebody could be expecting, all right? Huh. Your strong sense of empathy standing out right now compassion and nutrient nurturing hmm maybe there is a need for you to tap into your empress energy this week oh empress choice what choices are you going to make in love uh Maybe you are not trying to face something. Maybe this week there is something that you need to, that's up for review, okay? It has something to do with a love situation. Your choices in love, Empress. Maybe you need to make a decision when it comes to a love situation, what you doing. All right. Empress, what about the Empress? Empress, what about you, Empress? Empress, hello, yeah. So just have something to do with love, dating. Okay, this could even be making friends, but we got courtship though. <sighs> so Empress, somebody wanna court you, okay? You're gonna have to make a decision this week in love. Oh boy, Empress. Oh, we have pris prison limitation. Somebody could be wanting to court you, but you could be in some sort of isolation at this time. Confinement, maybe. Somebody feels like it's hard to court you this week. Air sign, somebody want to be with you. Somebody could be trying to, wanting you to loosen up a bit. All right, as long as it's her to loosen up a bit. <laughs> yeah. Air sign, Hmm. Gemini, Libra, Gemini's. Somebody feels like you're unavailable. Somebody could still be trying to figure out what they're going to, which way they're going here. What's going on? Empress. What's going on here? This week for the air signs. Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Someone got their eye on you. <laughs> you are doing your research. Somebody is doing their research. Air sign. Could be another air sign that's watching you. All right. But somebody doing their research. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Or somebody watching you is Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. What else? Okay. Divorce. So you don't, somebody don't want to split up. Break up in the reverse. No. A health issue may arise. Oh, boy. Things are getting serious. Somebody want to get serious, but somebody don't want to break up with someone. Somebody is spying to see if you broke up with someone or if you broke up with this fire sign or... um. 
somebody don't want you to let go. A fire sign don't want you to break up with them. <laughs> okay? Somebody could be seeing a health issue could arise. Health. expectations maybe you're not expecting something somebody is not expecting a breakup or they're not expecting something they're not expecting you to let go of someone or for somebody to let go of you but this is affecting someone's health maybe because of a karmic cycle something Ending for something new to begin. Yes, luck is on your side if you open your heart. All right, maybe to an earth sign. They could be letting go, making room. Okay, let's see what's going on. So, there is a need for you to... Uh, let go of something or someone this week. Okay. What is going on? Because someone wants to quit you. So somebody could feel like somebody is in between this. So somebody could be trying to find out more information. They're doing a research about what happened when the breakup with a breakup with a fire sign. Like, what the fuck happened? Maybe because somebody could be wanting to be with you, right? And somebody could be like, what happened when, when you broke up with this fire sign? Because something ain't... They feel like something isn't right or... Because you're isolated. You're so isolated. You're so distant or something. So somebody trying to find out what happened after this breakup or with this breakup because of your personality. Something about your personality. Somebody is noticing a change in your personality. Yeah. Somebody want to be your best friend? We got best friend. Earth mm -hmm. What's the health issue may arise? What is this? Health issue may arise. <sighs> Jesus. Yeah. Because of a breakup? Does somebody want to be more than friends? So, somebody feel like a divorce has caused some sort of health issue within you. You could be really loving on yourself, doing a lot of self-love. So, somebody feels like a health issue could have had a rise when there was some sort of divorce or breakup. They may feel like this divorce or breakup may have dimmed your light. Okay. Health issue may arise. Slacker. Hmm. A health issue may arise. You severed ties with someone to love yourself. And someone is avoiding doing the work. Or is somebody avoiding doing the work, taking shortcuts when it comes to loving themselves after a breakup? Or severing ties of a situation? There could be some sort of intimidation going on right now. Could somebody want to get closer? Somebody could be intimidated to get close to you or something. A smooth talker. So somebody could be trying to butter somebody up. Third party situation has receipts.
So somebody could be seeing you as like too receptive, waiting for something to happen. That's how somebody is viewing you. Okay. However this is, or that's how somebody is viewing someone. Maybe somebody was avoiding to do the work. They were trying to finesse somebody. A slacker. Maybe somebody tried to finesse a slacker. Maybe to not do the work on loving themselves after a breakup. Okay. So maybe somebody felt like they could talk someone out of not doing the healing work, the inner work after a breakup or something like that. <sighs> yeah. Somebody wanted someone to be in a distorted feminine energy. What is this? Fire sign. What about the fire sign? A fire sign could be a spiritual hater, hating on your beliefs, not liking your untraditional ways, and regret for being irresponsible. A fire sign that was being a hater is in regret. Someone regrets what they did to you, how they treated you, and how they contribute to the mess. They could have been irresponsible, lacking accountability, careless about the consequences of their actions. You can't rely on them. Okay. <laughs> okay. Wow. So we got ignored. So there's a fire sign that could have been a spiritual hater that's being ignored. Someone is at a distance. A strong emotional connection to one another. Far away in the reverse, there's no connection to someone. Or something like that. A spiritual hater. Also, so somebody could have did something, y'all. Because someone liked you. They ignored the reason why somebody did something. Could be a distorted masculine that abused their power with you, that was intimidated. No money, no talk. Somebody could be trying to get witchcraft done on someone that's gorgeous and pockets is full. This person could be acting a fool, whatever the fire sign is. Give me one card for the spiritual hater. 12 house, yeah. So this person is a spiritual hater. They could be pointing out things that they did saying it was you. Because somebody wants control. They have a need to control. They don't want something to change. You're, yeah. I don't know why this person wants to control your energy or how people see you or something. You're like irritating this person. Demons. Because they could be having money problems. And the truth is revealed in this situation. Hmm. Breakup and divorce. Breakup and divorce. What's this? The truth is revealed about what? What happened? Divorce. Somebody is impressed because somebody knows. They, they know that this person is a weird, twisted individual that betrayed you, a distorted masculine. Yeah. And because somebody was talking good shit about someone that was lying and stalking, they had no limit to how far they would go. Maybe after a breakup, somebody... Is seeing this person, whoever this fire sign is, I don't know, this is someone y'all were in a marriage with or a relationship with. 
um, or this is like a spectator, but I feel like there was somebody here that wanted control. So they were saying things, you know, about you or doing something. And a divorce. So somebody's impressed because you was talking good shit about somebody stalking you. Spreading lies and stalking. Somebody could be ignoring someone. They was playing a lot of games in this connection. This person could have been a false twin. They could be having legal issues. Somebody could be trying to call the legal issues for you. Someone is spying. Yeah, hey, whoever this is, they seeing somebody act a fool, a moocha, that's jealous. So somebody could be trying to find out more information. Why was somebody being so immature, childish and goofy, spying, acting a fool, jealous? Because somebody want to be more than friends with someone like you. Somebody can see you as doing well and they're jealous. Somebody can be jealous of your beauty. And somebody could be all up in your business. <sighs> Maybe trying to figure out who your friends are, your social class, your ranking. Because someone had a hidden agenda, agenda, narcissist, distorted, masculine, and it's intimidating. Because somebody, they trying to get to do they trying they have to pay somebody to do some witchcraft or something no money no talk witchcraft because someone wants to be more than friends hmm so somebody could be trying to find out more information about you y'all this week because somebody is jealous about something Somebody trying to find out who you are and why is this person so jealous, whoever the fire sign is, or why is this person so much in your energy? This is also giving that energy of like surviving a narcissist energy. <laughs> All right. And somebody's trying to find out more information. So this could be somebody that another lover of someone's for some of y'all that's watching y'all. going on this week with y'all ear signs. Okay. Cause somebody knows somebody is hooked or addicted or something like that. And they try to find out what you do to this person. To have them like this, but they're like acting out in a way like that's unhealthy or something. Stalking and spreading lies. And somebody's like impressed by you or something. You was talking good shit. Something you said about someone. We have sewer maiden. Could be using gadgets and technology with wisdom. Wow. 
unending sadness and of looking back. Endless regret, obsessive grief, negative nostalgia. Change is natural and good, and yes, it can hurt. This was a tempting offer at a high price. I'll show you who you can trust. Release your power. for alchemy. I'll show you who you can trust. Did somebody come together with someone after a breakup to because somebody didn't want you. They was trying to finesse somebody here to be a slacker. Maybe half do self loving after a breakup. Somebody wanted someone not to pay attention or heal themselves so that they could be an individual or whatever that is. Once upon a midnight dream, your ancestors said so release your power. So somebody could be um, acting a fool because they're jealous. All right. That you were able to heal from some sort of obsessive grief, negative nostalgia. I. Change is natural and good, and yes, it can hurt. Because something is changing here. Your ancestor said your Akashic libraries are available to you. Yeah, this person. Yeah, a great ending for a new beginning. You need some space in the situation. Now that you're this great leader, somebody is really like, don't want you to let them go. That's just basically what I'm getting this week for some of y'all. This person don't want you to let them go. Somebody could have been extremely toxic in your life. And um, it's like their energy is going to like, they're trying to project some sort of energy to gain some sort of control over you. They hate the fact that you don't, traditional ways is given like, you don't want to be how it used to be. You don't want to do how you used to. And they're frustrated with that energy, okay? Because they can't control this. A healed version of you. Okay. Yeah, they can't control some sort of healed version of you. And this person may want you to be in a um, depressive state or something. About love, your fourth house. Okay. Or about family. Something like that. Your signs. And if you are in that type of energy, it is time for you to take a look at it. All right. Assess the situation. See why you are feeling that way. Um, acknowledge the emotion and then let it go. Okay. Things are up for review. All right. So there could even be someone trying to block your heart chakra to someone else. Because they don't want you to move on. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> New relationship. Unexpected love is coming in. Okay. Wow. Yeah. You have to let some things go. All right, whatever energetically that you're holding on to, 
Because this is someone that's projecting this energy. It's like it's time to move around type of energy, y'all. What else? The meeting. Wow. Compatibility is key. Relating to someone, enjoying their company, aligning values, show compatibility in this new relationship. It's time for you to reconnect emotionally with someone. Yeah, but the hospitalized and vandalism is giving me some sort of energy that's within you, some sort of hurt energy that you may have to look at. Okay, that's maybe blocking you from being able to have this new relationship. All right, the new relationship in the meeting. We got hospitalization and medical expenses at the bottom. What else? Maybe it's really, it's going to cost someone if you don't open up your heart <laughs> to a situation. What else? new relationship anything else in this deck for the air signs wow and this you gotta be kidding me every every card that has something to do with relationship is coming out of this deck it says new relationship the meeting wedding like this is like someone you're going to marry all right Hmm. Maybe something that's going to cost you a lot. Uh, all right. What else? The meeting and wedding. What else for the air signs? Renovate in the reverse. So bundle of joy. Maybe this also is going to bring about a child. So if you are in childbearing years, there's no need for you to repair something old or damaged. This could be with someone you had a child with. So if you're holding on to something energetically, someone, it's time for the, you to release that pain or that memory, that whatever. Um, because there's no need for you to look back. There's no need for you to even entertain a thought anymore about something. Oh, right. Because you have something new. Wow. Yep. New and renewal. So there's some sort of new, something new on the horizons for you guys. Um, and it's a need for you to look at it, okay? Pay attention. Yeah, because something, it, be, it could be a struggle. Something could be really hard, or I don't want to use these cards. But something could be a struggle. Maybe you have to open your heart or something like that, air sign. Okay. Yeah, we got the King of Cups. Could be a water sign here that's coming towards you. Don't have to be. Or this is just somebody that got feelings for you. Okay. Let me see. Somebody could be wishing like you had give them a chance or something. 
somebody wants you to have the strength and courage to move forward with them or something like that. This is just straight up. <laughs> you have a new relationship. Meeting this person is going to turn into a marriage or a wedding. Sign card. This was coming towards you. All right. Something that's very happy. Wow. Reconcil a happy reconciliation or... You're making a judgment call to maybe look at something, highlight something. I'm just coming in for the air signs this week. Ugh, four of cups. So somebody feel like you're bored with the offer. Yeah. Because there's a lot of waiting here. And somebody could be heartbroken because they want to court you or something. But it's the so somebody can be trying to look at your past to see how y'all can move forward. I don't know why. All right, this person is, but maybe this person want to move forward with you, so they're trying to find out information about your past or something like that. For some of y'all, this could be somebody from your past. What's the obstacle? obstacle the five of cups grief sadness regret it's like crying over spilled milk things that did not work out in the past all right maybe somebody regret not working something out as well with you what's the outcome well that's good yeah. Well, it looks like you're going to move forward. Ace of Cups. Because there's, there's a true love coming into you, King of Swords. All right. There's a lot of love. Somebody actually love you. Maybe a King of Swords could be in love with you. But they could be waiting for you to make a choice. Somebody's waiting for you to make a choice. There could be a lot of conflict. Five of Wands with the Three of Wands to the Five of Wands or inner conflict. <sighs> All right, now. So somebody wants you to make a decision or choose them. Somebody love you. Okay, whatever this is. <laughs> Somebody wants to have like a clean slate with you. Yeah, it's time for something. What's the sun card? Eight of Pentacles. So something is somebody is putting in the work here. All right, Eight of Cups. Maybe something that's coming to light that somebody could be walking away or. Yeah, from you, Empress. Or coming towards you, Empress. Or somebody, something coming to light that somebody really wants to put the work in here. Maybe to get some, or somebody's been putting a lot of work in to get somebody to walk away from an Empress. Okay. What is the Eight of Pentacles? Maybe that's about to come to light. Justice, yeah, wow. Somebody could be working hard to get somebody stuck. They could be going through karma here for that. For trying to keep somebody stuck in a third party situation. All right, something's going to come to light that somebody could be working with the justice system as well to get somebody locked up. 
All right, what's justice? Knight of Swords. Maybe they working with the justice system to get something to hurry up or Knight of Swords, something is challenging. Something could be a heavy burden because something is a heavy burden or it's too hard to get something to go in their favor with a Two of Cups or they want to cause a heavy burden. For something to go in your favor with a Two of Cups, Ace of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. A King of Wands could be planning or work together to make you afraid of a new offer. Maybe because they secretly wanted to win at all costs so they could have lied to a King of Swords. Or a lawyer, or they lied to somebody about learning a lesson, or that's their plan. They're gonna lie to someone about learning a lesson by the Queen of Cups energy. Somebody could be upset because they could be. Getting some sort of karma for working together with someone. And they got exposed or something came to light at work. What they did. Somebody could be going through karma for cups. Their eyes coming in and somebody is like bored with the offer. What? If somebody is too busy not enjoying. Somebody's not in the present with the four of cups. The magician. So somebody feel like they missed the opportunity to pay somebody to do some healing work or to do something. They can't manifest something right now. It's the magician. High priestess. Yeah, I was going to say that. Somebody um really, really, really is trying to hide something here, y'all. What they're trying to do. They're trying to manifest something. Somebody has devised a plan to do something in secret. Whoever this person is, they're trying to win at all costs so they could be sneaking around. Intuitively or your intuition or listen to your intuition. Somebody's trying to manifest someone to miss an opportunity. They're trying to do this quietly. You see, she's got her shoes off. It's like sneaking in the window, sneaking. Like, shh, you know. Somebody could be trying to cross somebody's path. They want to win at all costs. They do. So they could be doing this in secret at night. Dream state, whatever. Somebody is trying to change someone's mind about something or someone. A king of swords. Maybe because this king of swords family or somebody feels left out in the cold because of a painful ending. They do not want to give up. They didn't want to give up until they brought a tower to someone's two of cups, ace of cups with the king of wands. So this is like revenge tactics. Somebody wanted revenge on somebody. Okay. So they've been trying to... Do damage. A king of swords. Could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Because their family unit or longevity or whatever, a group of people feel like they could be in poverty or feeling left out in the cold after some sort of betrayal. So somebody felt like they <clears throat> they want you to be just as miserable as them. Somebody knows 
there's something coming in for you. But a health, health issue could have arise with this person because of a divorce. And they were supposed to love themselves, but instead this person chose to do shortcuts. They didn't want to do the work. So they felt like, so they became a finesser. And the first thing they wanted to do was maybe control the way someone seen you or something. This person could be a spiritual hater of a fire sign. They have a need to control things. So they was pointing out things that you was they was doing, saying it was you. And they had hidden truths here because they had, were hiding something. Their 12th house is that they're a hidden enemy of a fire signs. And they've been stalking you, spreading a lot of lies. But you could have mentioned something and they are impressed. Okay. That you knew something about a breakup. Or that you knew to sever ties with someone. Or keep your distance or something. Five of Cups. What's the Five of Cups? Three of Pentacles. So they regret not working this out or making this plan. They thought they would get victory and success if they had control over something. Yeah. They feel like they should have made a practical decision. Five, three of Pentacles in the reverse. Somebody lost though because they planned it and worked. That's their obstacle. Yeah, Page of Pentacles because you learned the lesson. Okay. This Queen of Cups didn't want to give up. They wanted to keep going. Wounded Warrior. But you learned some sort of lesson. Somebody got to make a practical decision. What's the Page of Pentacles? To wait. So you could have learned some sort of lesson here about... Seeing something from a different perspective, Air Sign. And hey, well, because somebody wanted you to be stuck in the past, in a relationship, or about a relationship in the past, what happened in the past with a relationship, so that you can't move forward. Hmm. Six of Swords. What's the Six of Swords? King of Wands flipped out. What's the Six of Swords? So, somebody could have wanted you to be stuck on the King of Wands or something like that. Or stuck without taking action. They don't want you to take action or something. What's the Six of Swords? Move to more common waters. So it's time for you to move to more common waters. Wow. Because the wish is being granted. Healing Two of Cups. Ace of Cups. Yeah. It's time for you to receive something. Wow. This is good news. This is a message of a relationship coming in for you. Alright. Somebody has feelings for you. It could be a king of cups, king of pentacles. But there's a wish of a two of cups situation coming forward for you, air sign this week. What's the star? The devil. Nine of Cups. Somebody mad as hell that your wish is coming true. You're moving forward. We got the devil in the in the four of wands. Somebody could be jealous 
of this. They wish you were afraid to get into a relationship. That's what somebody is wishing. It's the devil. The hell? Four of Wands. Wow. In the past. That's the truth. Somebody wish you was afraid to get into a relationship. That's truth and clarity. Because somebody knows it's time for you to have a brand new passion in the beginning. And somebody is thinking about you hard, Queen of Swords. Because something is being balanced out and they heard that something backfired. Because you're not giving up on love. Four of Wands. So somebody know you're healing and you're not giving up on love. Despite of whatever happened in the past. What's the Four of Wands? Yeah. Somebody could be wanting to tell you how they feel. Whatever somebody is saying, Eight of Wands, they are afraid because there is something tangible here for you. And they're afraid you're going to come into union with somebody. Okay. Or there's a Queen of Cups that somebody was in a relationship with that is very much so angry still or has a lot of hate or something or a lot of fear, something like that. They wish somebody just move on or that y'all can move to more calmer waters or <sighs> maybe this person wanted to reconcile with you, but you could be in a new relationship or something like that. Maybe somebody thought that y'all would be together eventually or something. Yeah, mental illness. Somebody was trying to get you fired or put out. What the hell? In the summertime. Or somebody could be jealous that you want to be you in a relationship with this water sign. Whoever that is. And they could be trying to sabotage something for you. Take it as it resonates. They did this a year ago. <clears throat> We had the summertime and in the fall, a woman, they got a shortcut. Uh, they feel like you wasn't destined to be a king or a queen. She is so mad. She's trying to blackmail you with a phone conversation. They want to learn a hard lesson. The feds is watching this person. L. Leo. <clears throat> like somebody is tripping. The police is watching somebody. Return to sender time saying they saw the as fuck. Man, somebody not doing too good, y'all. Yeah, divine intervention. He trying to set her up. They knew you was connected to the all that is and all that will ever be. Also, somebody wish that you was jealous that they got married to a queen of cups or... Yeah. I don't know why. Well, maybe because they still got feelings for you. <clears throat> okay. And he is so mad. Because they have legal issues. Truck driver. Someone getting arrested because they phone tapped. Heart chakra magic backfiring. Somebody is 100% LGBTQ. A Scorpio. They so attracted to you, but you heard the next to He walking away from a karmic. A Libra. It's not your fault that they suffering from karma. They looking at your picture. They feel like you're looking good. They can't get over you at all. Okay. They feel bad for what they did. 
somebody like you because you're not easy. Somebody's still in love with you, but they feel bad for what they did. Okay, in the winter time. God is blocking all negative energy projections. They created a mess with hope that somebody can help them fix it. Your child's father failed you and they sorry. This person could be bisexual or on a DL. <clears throat> they want you to unblock them. They try to hack your devices and they get in locked out. A Chinese man or a woman? What the fuck? Expect positive changes. We got a police officer, a Sagittarius. <clears throat> they could be getting karma, return the sender to all involved, known or unknown. E. Somebody could be physically or verbally abusive because all blockages are removed. Pisces. I try and block you in, you know, air sign. And of course, air sign. Whoever y'all got in y'all energy, okay, they are very much so trying to hide in y'all energy. Um, <clears throat> and that's what took, it feels like that's what, it's like somebody didn't want this message to come out or something. On how they've been feeling or what they've been doing here. Yeah. They know they messed up because they knew they messed up bad. They didn't want this to come out. <sighs> they know you're 100% heterosexual. All right. Stalker alert. Somebody could be stalking you. Return and center times 10. A white man or a woman. Zaddy home let them know. Everything is backfiring on them in a group. Q. Somebody was trying to find a way to run into you. A fake friend that was GPS tracking you. A black man or a woman. A niece or nephew. They did love or lust spells. They didn't want you to know who your true emperor is. <clears throat> they lost everything coming for you. They want to be with you bad. Somebody want to be with you bad. If you're reading this, it's too late. You was the one they about to lose you for good. Somebody can't stop missing you. You mean everything to them. You got that WAP energy. That you got that comeback. I finished business in love with a fire sign three years ago. <clears throat> I finished business in love with a earth sign, Filipino man or a woman. Beware, they might have an STD. Divine intervention, divine bodyguards, because somebody is not of the light. Yes, they lie to you about everything. Your spirit guides is stepping in. <clears throat> Unfinished business in love with an air sign. Today, Aries. <sighs> Ten years ago, a celebrity was stalking you. Big money coming in. Aquarius, them hexes and curses is backfiring on them. On Sunday. I hope this helps.